Catherine, it's good to have you. And first of all, I mean, there's a lot of headlines about the dire situation that a lot of state and local governments and budgets are in. How is that impacting the muni market today? Uh, thank you for having me. Uh, certainly, um, there's you know we're waiting for the stimulus uh, to come out here to potentially help the state and local economies. Um, waiting for this next round, uh, and of course uh, we see that uh, Speaker Pelosi and, and, and Secretary Mnuchin are getting closer. However, there are certainly differences that remain. One of those, of course, is the aid for state and local economies that would uh, certainly help. It looks like less likely before the election. Uh, perhaps after there could be a lame duck session, but uh, we view that most likely in the first quarter, once a new Congress is in place, that we're going to see another stimulus package for these municipalities. It, it sounds like, yeah, and for municipal bonds, it sounds like that that relief round is really, really important. It's obviously been in the Democratic bill for a while, uh, not so much on the Republican side. What makes you confident that either way it, that relief will be included? Well, you know, we, we feel that uh, certainly under a Democratic uh, administration, there's going to be a larger federal uh, spending plan and a federal uh, fiscal uh, stimulus plan for state and governments, state and local governments that will improve, of course, the muni credit uh, fundamentals, which would be uh, certainly helpful. This would minimize layoffs, uh, furloughs, in addition to cuts to many essential service and uh, social safety net programs at a time when really the demand for services and programs are the greatest. You know, under a, a Republican uh, administration, certainly less aid, uh, if any, uh, would result ultimately, though, in uh, states having to balance their budgets, which we know they have to do. The austerity measures will take place where they will cut spending and increase taxes. Mm -hmm. And mm. that will be necessary. And in which case, yep. if higher taxes are coming then for sure you can see why people would be attracted to muni bonds. I know there are some parts kind of tactically of the market that you would recommend. Transports are one of them, tolls, um, even some airports. Why? Well, you know, surprisingly, airports uh, is an area where there has been more bipartisan support. Uh, various Democratic and Republican proposals have included, you know, additional aid for airports. In addition to the $10 billion that they already received from the CARES Act, we're seeing increase in travel right now, so that's an area that we certainly like. Tolls is also another area where we've seen a pickup in driving, uh, in this working from home, less mass transit. It's an also an area where we would expect additional aid to help support that sector as well. And so uh, certainly seeing uh, positive uh, development in, in those sectors. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.